Did you know that in Ontario, your service dog does not have to legally wear a vest? So I can take my service dog, Theo, anywhere when he is out of vest. That means if I've forgotten it at home, if it got a bit dirty, anything could happen and he is still legally allowed to go anywhere in Ontario out of vest. Now, why do I have a vest for him then? Actually, he's got two. He has his puppy vest when he was in training and then his official vest from when we got certified. They gave us a much nicer one than the $20 one I found on Amazon for our training purposes. Um, the reason I do this is number one, because it helps signal to people that he should be allowed there. I don't really want to deal with a bunch of confrontation while I do carry around my uh, doctor's note and his training certificate with me at all times. I like wear a fanny pack that has like his treats, his poop bags, all of that in it at the same time. Um, I've only had to pull it out twice in my life that wasn't at an airport. Um, both times at libraries, oddly, apparently libraries are pretty meh about service dogs, but also because it helps signal to other people that he is working and should not be touched. So. Basically, even though we do not have to have this, if you are a service dog handler in Ontario, I highly recommend it. The two times I've taken Theo somewhere out of vest, it was honestly just a hassle. Like the people were fine with it. I didn't need to pull out the paperwork. It was more the other people in the vicinity, not the owners of the establishment that caused trouble because they would try and get his attention a lot more. They would try to pet him and they didn't really understand what he was doing. So even though he would move out of the way of like other people, he does, he's pretty good about it. It's still, it's a lot harder for them to understand if he's not in a vest. Now, the type of vest you have is also going to be a little bit different depending on what you need. Um, a mobility vest will have like the handle on top and that tends to signal pretty easily to people that this is a working dog. The new plethora of dogs wearing like the full on harnesses actually kind of made life harder for us because Theo's vest is a simple like black harness with um, the mesh on the back where the stickers go. That looks a lot like a normal dog harness at first glance, um, which does get a bit confusing. So I, what I often do, um, if someone starts to look at me and ask, like, what is he there for? I will have him circle me and then they will get like a full picture of what's on his vest. And that does clarify it a little bit better. And it just shows that vests can really help, like, alleviate you having to explain a lot more about your situation, which like we have to do enough. So let's just take it out of the situation. And since this is a video about him, we got to show off the pretty boy. This is Theo. 